Hi guys, welcome back to a brand new part where we go straight to sleep again. Yeah, it's, it's, it's gonna be a busy night. I feel a strange weight pressing down on my body. Is this the stress of comedy or this fret weighing on me? Oh, I thought I was gonna go into the... It may be crowded, but it looks like you can still grab a seat if you're lucky. Hmm. Well, while we're raiding the train, we could have got some downtime. I wonder if we could put it to good use. Like, read a book, I guess? What's wrong? You don't look so good. I've been feeling... haven't been feeling well lately. My head's all foggy and I have no energy. I've tried every drug at the pharmacy, but nothing works. Do I have some new well, virus? Is it one of those on <laughs> onset of a psychotic breakdown? What, what should I do? Am I going to die? Calm down, calm down. Let's go to the clinic. Come on. I'm sure the doctor can prescribe something that'll fix you right off. Doctors have the best medicine, huh? Hey, wasn't there one customer at the bunks a doctor? Do you have a... Do you have a cold? Do, do you have a cold? Then why are we talking about this? No. I just thought it might be nice to have some strong medicines to use in the palace. Your morning, sorry, what are you doing here? Let's head to school together. I mean, it's right there, but whatever. Yeah, what is that? I was all... Mo Mo Mona, could you stick... St your head's sticking out. Bum. Bum. Hey, we're meeting at the... Hold on, alright. Don't text me now, we're in class. Well, you mean you're actually listening to all this crap? Yeah, but none of it's really sticking to gay. I know, right? Anyway, hide out after school. Where exactly hide out? The school roof. Wait, we can still go up there? Yeah, I'll let you in. Well, I'll be waiting. Just come on once school's over. Gotcha. I'm gonna find you. I'm gonna find you if you're late. Hey, Jarvis. You'll pay attention. Is that how you listen when someone's talking to you? I feel murderous intent. Oh, that looked like it hurt. It hit him right in the forehead. That's what you get for daydreaming. Kids these days have no respect for their elders. Good grief, looks like you need more proficiency to complete, completely dodge that. Thanks. Looks like we're all here. Okay, let's get going. Hold on, it's still too early for us to head to the palace. But why? Don't we just gotta steal that treasure thing? Don't underestimate the dangers of that place. We need to prepare. I see. Ain't that persona shit we got enough to deal with it? That's exactly what I mean when I say don't underestimate it. You'll die if you mess up in there. Oh, Jesus. So again, we need to prepare before we head in. I see. But how exactly are we supposed to do that? I'm glad you asked, Lady On. First, we'll need to find better equipment for all of you. You talking about weapons? Oh, I know a kick-ass place. In that case, you can handle that side of things. The only other thing would be stocking up on medicine. Fatigue is unavoidable in a palace. It's true. And where can we get medicine? Don't worry. I know just the place. I hope you look forward to it, Lady On. What? Now then, he and I have some business in Yongen. So let's head off for today. Uh... uh, uh, uh I don't have any business. Come with me. I won't be able to get close enough by myself. Can I talk? Hey, remember that uh, customer you met at La Bank yesterday? The doctor who prescribes medication. After a quick examination, she was sitting at the booth. Yeah, I remember. Actually, I've just realized something. If she's the kind of doctor who gets sketchy rumors like that, maybe she'll help us out. She's somewhere in the neighborhood, right? Take me to her. I see the clinic. It's right by the movie theater. This is the clinic that the chief mentioned. Now. How can we get them to give us some medicine? Well, I guess that's the only choice we have. All right, well, let's just make let's shit up. Go for it. All right, let's step inside. I don't feel good about this. Well, is this your first visit? Hmm, I feel like I've seen you somewhere before. At La Bonk. Hmm, well, whatever. So what are you here for today? Uh, my body f feels lethargic. Fine. Please head to the exam room.
In a case like yours, it's usually just due to stress. Oh, thanks. I'm going to prescribe you some pain relievers, okay? Okay. Actually, I still need to restock those. So, let's go with sleeping pills instead. Sleep is the best medicine anyway. Okay. Which type of pill do you want? A sweet tasting one or a bitter one? Uh, whichever. How about a stinky one then? Just kidding. There's no such pill. All right. Why don't we stop beating around the bush? <laughs> you're not sick at all, are you? I'm not as dumb as I look, you know. <laughs> oh, damn. I'm guessing you're here because you heard the rumors about me. Hmm? Uh, that's right. <laughs> I've been caught. You're one of those patients with an ulterior motive, huh? What's the world coming to? I guess high school kids have it tough nowadays, too. Oh, you have no idea. Well, fine. I'll prescribe you some medication. But only medication that will help you recover your health. Sounds good. I guess it's fine. You seem pretty earnest. And you don't look like you'll be any trouble. Uh, yeah. This is my private practice. All the medicine I dispense is original. I have a license to make my own formulas. You've likely seen them being sold at various hospitals. It's your responsibility to take care of yourself. So, if that's okay with you, stop by any time. Great. It's nice that you're so quick on the uptake. Saves me the hassle. Yeah, thank God. Yeah. You're a pretty weird kid, you know? Well, as long as you don't cause me any trouble, it's not my problem. This is all I got right now. Okay, which one? Okay. Uh uh I need You want that one? Yeah. Thanks. Take care. Okay, cool. What's the reason for your visit? Do you have a cold, stomach ache, athlete's food? Whatever it is, you'll need to take a number. Enough of this. You're the one who, who could have developed that type of medicine. I'm afraid I have no idea what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Rumor has it it's a drug so potent it can give a person unlimited power. Really? That's news to me. <laughs> Developing experimental drugs, medicine, and herbal remedies violates all health regulations. Are you attempting to create a super stimulant? A drug that will only become a social issue. You're really persistent, you know that? I'm just a quack. The police may not be taking action, but I imagine the media will soon pick up on it. You intend to ruin my reputation again, huh? You're a disgrace for the medical community. What's with that look? That was your mistake, was it not? I won't be responsible for your criminal actions. Dispose of that medicine immediately and resign. The name Tay Tegmi will never... Hey, is somebody there? Jeez, that almost caught us. Sounded like they were talking about something dangerous. Could be that. Could be that woman I was holding some extra strong medicine. We should use that. I agree. If it's strong, it might come in handy at the palace. All right, let's check back when it come, uh, isn't there. We shouldn't involve people who have nothing to do with the, to do with this. Keep the Phantom Thieves a secret, okay? Anyway, great work. That went really well. You know the store I mentioned with model guns? It's in Shubio. I can go with you if you want. Sounds good. Sweet. Well, let's figure out where to meet. You know how to get to Shibuya Station, yeah. Hey, I can't make it. Can I trust you guys to check the place out for me? You can't come? Not tomorrow. I made plans to see you in hospital. All right, gotcha. Don't worry, we got this. We'll see you in Shibuya, Salty. We'll be in the front of the station. We might be able to get our hands on some decent stuff if this store really has model guns. Sounds great. Well, we can leave that for tomorrow. Let's go home. Okay. It's going smoothly so far. Once we prepared, let's take on the palace. That's where the real fun starts. Got it? Okay, well, let me save it real quick. Uh, and I'm back, and I'm now going to sleep. Don't worry about it. I forgot to hit record. It's fine. It's Sunday. What's up? Looks like you made it. 
The shop's on Central Street. We've got to go through the crossing to get there. That's the huge Shibuya crossing. It's huge intersection with people crossing the street from every direction. Once we get past that, we'll pretty much be at Central let's Stage. Alright, let's get going. Everyone, wake up! This country is twisted. While Japanese society may appear to be thriving, many young people have not been as blessed as their elders. They have no jobs, no savings. No financial security whatsoever. These young people should be tackling their futures head on. But instead, they're too busy merely trying to survive. People give speeches all the time. Plus, politics are pretty boring anyways. Yeah, it's crazy. Actually, can I go on the ground? Let's just not worry about that. Shop can be pretty confusing to find sometimes. Yeah, I'm, I'm with you. Hey, hey, it's this way. Yeah. That's a pretty legit heart. Uh, this is exciting. Oh, uh, this sort of are you into this, this sort of military stuff? Anyway, let's check it out. What's inside? I have no money to spend on this. You know what you want yet? Are you looking for recommendations? I don't know, just buy whatever looks interesting to you. Ugh, some customer service. Fine, what do you want? An automatic? A revolver? A revolver. Uh, automatic? Automatic fire, you f- Dude, why are you talking about cars now? Oh my god, what the hell? Listen, this here's an enthusiast shop. My regulars will be mad if I let a casual like you hang around. I'm not a freaking casual. I bought shit from here like last week. <sighs> Can't remember you. <laughs> you bastard. And you, looking for something? Uh, fancy model gone. Oh, you a collector? <laughs> You're way more interested than Blondie over there. Oh, cheers. Oh, shut it. Anyways, you should have said before you two are enthusiasts. I'm always up for helping fresh faces. Some precautions first, though. Don't go around pointing them at other people. Keep them in a bag or something if you're outside. Got it. Don't let the fuzz catch wind of you having them. I don't need them coming around here. <laughs> we hate cops. I can't think of anything. Now, if you look close, you'll be able to tell these are models. Real guns feel different. Maybe someday I'll show you the real good stuff, though. If you got the guts for it, of course. Or we build up the social link. But for now, you get the beginner selection. Just sit tight. I'll bring him out. <laughs> we did it, dude. We totally got to go for some fancy shit, right? Oh, I want him to shine. Oh, and here's the cash for mine. Pick me out something good. Well, thank God. Uh, yeah, I know how to buy equipment game. Okay. Sounds good. Hmm. Yeah, we'll just go for... That's what you're choosing? You like it? Yep. Alright, which one? Uh... So that would be 4,600. Too much. All right. All right. Which one? That's way too much. That's way too much. Okay, I think they're all gonna be way too much. Okay. All 
right? Which one? <sighs> All right. Sounds good. Goggles that protect eyes from harm. I know. Uh, no, but you resist, forget, resist dizzy, re resist sleep. All right, which one? Resist dizzy. Yeah, that's something you should know. I don't buy off any model guns from other people, so keep that in mind. I don't want to deal with any problems buying something that's already been modified. And that's what I gotta say. Okay, well that's that's cool. Anyways, I'll have I'll have you get chosen from now on. Get the strongest looking one. subway driver from the accident was acting really odd during his testimony hearing oh Are you talking about that psychotic whatever thing people are going on about oh yeah i heard it completely alters your personality damn this is saying the driver couldn't even speak when they tried asking him questions only an idiot would believe a preposterous story like that that's crazy no oh, sorry but we're closing soon how rude this must be why you don't get many customers. Your coffee's actually not half bad. The beans must be lamenting the sorry state of this store. Wow. Thanks for stopping in. Please come again. Hm. I'm only trying to help you fix your business. Thanks for the coffee, at least. Jeez, what a pain. Oh, what do you want? If you're bored, go wash some dishes or something. Uh, how's business? <laughs> doesn't concern you. It's all good as long as the shop doesn't fail. I'm not gonna go wearing a fake smile. Is that a motto of yours? No, nothing like that. As long as I'm here, the world leaves me be. I see. No annoyances or troublesome people to deal with. It's like my own personal hideaway. I see. I'd be kind of screwed if I lost it. But I guess you would be too. So you better at least try and be useful around here. Anyway, I'm leaving now. Don't cause any trouble. Oh, oh, more text. So I went to see Shu at the hospital. How was she? Her condition is stable. They don't know when she will regain consciousness though. I'm sure she'll be okay. Yeah. She'll get better, I know it. I just need to believe in her. But I'll never forgive Kamashida. He's going to pay for what he did no matter what. We're just about ready to go to the palace. We just need to assemble some infiltration tools. Clean off that desk back there so we can use it. That desk, hurry! Let's clean this. Great. Now you can make things whenever you want. I'll provide the materials this time. Try making a lock pick. Okay. Don't think too hard about it. You'll get the hang of it. Okay. Let's make a lock pick. Everyone starts off a little clumsy. Don't be sad if it doesn't go well at first, okay? Okay. We should be able to use this. Yay! Yeah. We should be ready now. We're heading into the palace tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. Good morning. Come on, hurry up and get to class. Good morning. Oh, good morning. That admirable behavior won't do you any good once you're expelled. Well, that wraps up the homeroom period. Sounds great. <clears throat> A word with you, please. There's something I'd like to ask you. 
It won't take long. I see you're already getting on top of the problem I'd mentioned this morning, Miss Kawakami. I appreciate the support. Oh. Thank you again. Oh, you know this guy, Yoshizawa? Yes. He lent me a helping hand earlier. I recommend you steer clear of the likes of him if you have any consideration for your future. Wow. Remember the discussion we just had? There are a number of students in this school you shouldn't get involved with. This one's at the top of the list. Wow. Oh, the delinquent transfer student? Sorry to interrupt, but I need to use the guidance office. Oh, pardon me. We should be going too. Don't want to get in the way of guiding this delinquent and all. Please excuse us. After you. Okay. I'm gonna get straight to the point. Did something happen between you and Mr. Kamoshida? Why do you ask? Well, there was that little exchange just now, but that's not all. He gave me a brief lecture this morning, and your name came up. Something about the dangers of a lack of supervision. I don't mean to pry, but just make sure you don't go causing trouble, okay? Oh, and one more thing. That girl outside the office? You didn't make a pass at her, did you? Uh, of course not. All right. Mr. Kamoshida has a real close eye on you. Apparently, you've been getting involved with Sakamoto-kun. Yeah, don't worry about it. You acquainted with Yoshizawa-san as well. Maybe you're just naturally drawn to athletes? Sorry, bad joke. That's all I wanted to discuss. You're free to go. So I saw Kamoshida at the school gate this morning. He was just standing there looking at me with the shit-eating grin on his face. Oh, that's annoying. He's probably mocking you. Honestly, seeing that got me even more fired up about this. We're definitely going to pull this off. Yeah, I'm worried about Shiho, but I want to concentrate on this operation too. And I won't let myself get exhausted like last time. The board meeting May 2nd, right? we got to take care of him before then. I'm ready for this. Same goes for me. Me too. I'm, I'll do my best. Not going without me, okay? Yeah, you better let us know if you're going to the palace. Okay, we're 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 yeah, we're we're chatter chatter chatter. Okay. Okay. Well, we ain't doing that yet. Did it? Did it? Did it? Let's do it. Now where's the? Excuse me. Um. I'll just, it's my job to explain the rules of the library. So first time through this. So, using the library. Okay, we're gonna borrow a book. Are you a second yet? Oh, that could be a transfer store. I keep hearing about. Yup, I knew it. Um, I don't mean to be rude, but maybe you shouldn't come here. Seeing you're scaring the other students. No, I don't mean that you can't use the library, but... Guess you're not welcomed. You're not welcomed anywhere you go. I guess there's nothing we can do about it. The other students are scared of you. I'm, I'm feeling more hostility than anything else. Check your study corner. Looks like you can raise your knowledge and guts here. What would you like? I'd like to borrow a book. You can only borrow one book at a time. Be sure to return it once you finish reading it. Uh, I'll take that. Pirate religion sounds interesting. Okay. No, wrong button. Uh, we want to go underground mole. Need. Ah. 
That's a shoe store. Right, come on, you gotta have what I need. Okay, I guess not. This place? Oh, damn. Okay. So, uh... Welcome. Oh, wait, no, no, I need this place. What would you like? Okay, right. We're, we're, we're doing it. We're, doing, we're fine. I'm just running around. Okay. Just need to go to the sh shop first. Oh, what do you want? Ah. Uh, not here. Isn't there like a junk shop? Oh, that's the laundromat. Hmm. Yeah, where's the second hand shop? Unless this recycle center is the second. Yeah, this is the second hand shop. Of course it is. Yeah, don't worry about it. All right. Now let's go over to... The medical clinic. I should ask her about the enhancing drug. What are you here for today? Uh, got any special medicine? Huh? Huh? Now remember, you're the kid who was at LeBanc. Regular medicine won't do the trick. Uh, please, I beg you. <sighs> Very well. Just head to the examination room. Oh. Th that medicine, huh? Oh. To do. So which conversation of mine did you eavesdrop on to hear that? It was obvious actually, you call that hiding. Not that I care of course. I was going to dispose of that medicine anyway, I got a little too carried away with it. But tell me, why would a high schooler like yourself be so interested in that medicine? It's very strange indeed, you don't seem to be very athletic so... What exactly are you up to? It's for studying. Huh? Studying? Oh, for your entrance exams. So you're looking to improve your concentration and reduce your fatigue. Hmm, that's not the best idea. But if you want to do... Take care. Then good luck. I have no obligation to help you with that. Why don't you have an energy drink or something? I need that medicine. You're really annoying, you know that. That medicine is really expensive, and it's not something a high scholar can get his hands on. It costs almost as much as a car. Got it? So how about you just go home? Can I work for it? 
what, like a part-timer help. Do you consider yourself someone with a good amount of stamina? Uh, yes. I mean, I've been looking for a young person around your age to help me out. Oh, but I haven't been able to find one even after putting an ad in the paper. Are you up for it? Uh, what would I be doing? <laughs> do you want it to do it or not? Okay then, you'll be participating in my clinical trials for my medicine. Oh no. Hang on, it'll be I'll be right back. Oh Jesus. Here you go. Worried about the side effects, huh? Well you can relax. Rest assured my autopsy is is guaranteed to find out what exactly part cured you. Did you change your mind? Why aren't you gonna take it? That's, the exit's right there if you want to leave. If I don't drink this Takami probably won't sell me her medicine. Well, go on. Bottoms up! What? I can't believe you actually drank it. Bitter yet sour. It's beyond description. However, it's nothing I can't handle. Wow, still doing okay, huh? Hmm, not bad for a high schooler. Uh... Well, game over, I guess. I survived. Good evening. Oh, what's up? Do you remember anything from the moment you took the medicine until now? Nope, completely blacked out. Hmm. By the look in your eyes, I'd say you don't. Nope. You briefly woke from your coma, but you were completely dazed during the entire examination. You eventually lost consciousness, and fell back asleep. Are you out of your mind? Only an idiot would have drank that. Uh... It's, it's for my exams. Fine. By the way, the reason you lost consciousness was because of the taste. It produces a foul smell when it mixes with gastric juices. Similar to Sir Stroming. Oh well. All that matters is that thanks to you, I was able to get some good data. Oh, that's nice. Okay, it's my turn to make good on my part of the deal. That's... I don't want the general public to know about my original medicines. Sounds good. So, you're strictly prohibited from disclosing what happens here to anyone. Understood? Uh, of, of course. Then it's a deal. Yay! As long as you come here for it, I'll give you the medicine at a good price whenever you want. Okay. I may even add additional selections in time. Sounds good. I look forward to your continued patronage. Oh, okay, we're t time traveling again. Considering all the actions you've taken, you must have had someone with medical expertise. Yes. Who? And how did you treat your wounds? It'll be easy to find out who if we look into this, you know. We did it! I am thou. Yeah! Thou art I. Yeah, you are. Thou hast acquired a new vow. Of course. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. I see. With the birth of the death persona, I oh. shall obtain the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Increases the selection of healing items at the clinic. Nice. All right. Choosing personas of death, I will grant them any XP's birth. Yep, yep, okay. So, when can you come back for the next clinical trial? Oh, you don't remember that part either? Well, I was saying that teenage test subjects are quite valuable in the medical research industry. I see. So, I'll provide you the medicine for your entrance exams, and in exchange, you'll be my guinea pig. I see. I have to perfect this medicine. Okay. If you're able to move now, you can go home. All right. Take care. I feel like cooperating this shading clinic trial has increased my guts. Hey. 
Oh yeah, I'll contact you when I'm done prepping for the next clinical trial. And I'll put together some compensation by then for all your efforts today. But you're not getting that in writing. Based on today's result, I think I can whip up some new medicine for the next time. Drop by when you're ready for it. Please go easy on me. <laughs> we'll see, that's all up to you. Oh god. You live pretty close, right? You might still feel some distance, so take it easy on your way home. It's not really in the mood to write up autopsies, so take care of yourself. Hey. Better not to be any trouble. Just make you make one you make just one mistake and your life's over. Instead of hanging around, you should be studying or something. If there aren't any customers, you can use the shop. Thanks. Uh -huh. You don't need to thank me. I'm just telling you to stay out of trouble. If you're gonna study, you can use that table. Just don't leave the place covered in a razor crumbs, all right? Oh, that's right. One of my customers mentions the counter's pretty comfortable place to read. Well, your time is yours to spend. Just make sure it's after my customers are gone. Oh, hey, if you want to clean the shop, I'm not going to turn you down. The cleaning stuff's in the bathroom. Okay. Okay, let's let's do this crossword puzzle. Alright, we'll play the crossword puzzle. Hmm. Ah. Ah. Oh, what is it? You know, I've never never been good at crossword puzzles. He says as he completes the crossword puzzle. Don't worry about it. How are schools how are school years divided? Yeah, semesters, by the way. Make sure I got this right. Many school years separate into year two, three, and semesters. In Japan, the new semester begins in April. The government divided the year differently. For example, Ju July to June is wheat year, and October to September is the sugar year, or the pesticide year. All right. Nice. Oh wow! Even I couldn't figure that one out. Really? Maybe you got a bit smart after solving the crossword puzzles. Okay. Well, let me clean my room for a bit. Cats like, I mean, like cleanliness, plus there might be some treasure hidden here, you know? Oh. Let's clean this up. That's incredible. Politics, laws, and philosophy, these all like sound some pretty different books. Take one at least. A little bit of it will go a long way. Take this one too, should be an easy read, right? I wanted this one, it's mixed with all these different books. Well, I suppose it doesn't matter. Okay. This is a good opportunity. The floor over there looking pretty messy too. Let's clean everything up while we're at it. Oh, oh look at that, the plant is still alive. We can decorate it with. Okay. Nice. Even a jury room can be brightened up with a little green foliage. Let's take good care of this plant so it won't dry up and wither away. Yeah. This room feels a little more comfortable now. And just uh, as I predicted, we found a treasure, but it's a CRTV. What is wrong with a CRTV? You can't watch any broadcast without a tuner. It'd be a waste just to let it sit here, though. Is there a place where we could get a home appliance for cheap? Well, anyway, good work. Let's take a break. Show's day! I thought I'd get a girl from once I was in high school, but I'm not having any luck at all. Is there something wrong with me? Yes, there is. Maybe self-improvement is the answer. Try reading some books. You'll get more <laughs> than just some knowledge out of them, and it'll make you better in conversations. I've already got my book. Uh, you'll be desirable if more intelligent. It'll take hard work, though. Won't happen overnight. Yeah, but books make me sleepy. <laughs> I guess I can not I can give it a go, though. If it help me make me more popular with the ladies. Oh, is the library where you go to borrow books? Nice. Reading books is an important way to expand your mind. We just found a... Books are great. Yeah, we found a bunch of books, Morgana. I totally agree. 
Yeah, we already know we can go to this. We've been there already. I think there's a bookstore over at Central Street. We got books. We got books for days. Let's get started. Hi there, everyone. I'm Mr. Haruto, your biology teacher. Oh, you must all be shocked by what happened with Susie-san. It was a shock to me too. Although I can relate to how she felt, her eyes were devoid of life as they looked upon the sad, hopeless world. Well, I suppose everyone views the world differently. Let's have a test. Try to answer this. You there, take a look at this. Between A and B, which line seems longer? They're the same. This is it. You do know. Huh, that's correct. It seems your eyes see the truth. This is an optical illusion. Some people see it correctly and some do not. It isn't strange that they view the same image differently. Humans don't see the world as it is. We simply process visual information with our brain. Wow, really? Jarvis Kun seems kind of smart, doesn't he? Wow, you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. Yeah, it's crazy. How you see the world is nothing more than a trick of the mind. It's it's all mere cognition. There is no proof that the world each of us sees is the same. How you see the world depends on your brain's cognition, huh? Optical illusions and the metaphors might be more similar than you think. That's crazy. Hey, right, where are you right now? Uh, I haven't. I'm sitting in the classroom. I'm still at the school too. I'm by the staircase outside the classroom. Think we should head into the palace today? I haven't decided. I thought we're running on the other day, we're running around the palace. Maybe it's because I haven't been moving around much lately, but I feel like I'm getting weak. We're probably going to run into some pretty tough shadows too. We should try and get stronger too. It's sunny outside, perfect for training. So you want to get the blood pumping? Yeah, let's, let's go do some training with... Okay. Alright. Okay, well, let me just save it real quick, and I guess, uh... We're gonna hang out. Okay, here we go. Man, this place brings back memories. This is my secret training spot, uh, was, but when I was on the track team. Actually, I've been thinking about trying to run again. Fighting in that other world was total shock. I couldn't move like I used to. It just felt lame. So I started thinking, maybe I need to build up my muscles again. Exactly. Anything got to be better than this flimsy body, right? Plus, maybe I'll be able to help out a little more. I'm counting on you. <laughs> I'm totally going to wreck you expectations. I mean that in a good way. Anyway, you act like it's only me who's going to be doing this. You're getting in on too. Come on, man. Don't look so surprised. Why do you think I had you go and change into that? It'd be pointless if I was, if I was the only one getting super fast, right? All right, I'm going to do some knee lift sprints. You stop with the normal ones. I ran around the school with Ryuji. Damn, my legs aren't all tight. Training's hard, man. Before Kamashida came along, the track team was the biggest thing the school had going for it. But it all changed after he got our coach fired and took over as the sub. That bastard, right from the start, he was trying to get rid of us. He'd give us all crazy workouts, then we couldn't do them, he'd add even more on top of that. Day after day was nothing but bullshit. It was going after me especially. He knew, he knew I was the kind of guy who'd fight back. If my time dropped even a little, he'd cuss me out. Then on top of that, he brought up my parents. Uh, what about them? The truth is, mom is the only one I got. All my dad did when he was still around was drink. Sometimes he'd even beat me or my mom. I don't know what the, how that bastard Kamashita found out, but he told the whole goddamn team. As you can guess, I lost it and hit him. It was like he wanted me to do it though. He called it an act of violence and shut the team down. Thanks to that, the other, other guys on the team treat me like some kind of traitor. And they ain't wrong, because of me, they all lost the shot at the championship. 
Do you want to go back? To the track team? Nah. How could I after that? Come on, don't ask me the tough questions like that. I'm not very smart, you know. Anyway, it doesn't matter now. That's all in the past. Only thing I think about the future now. That's what we're going to do. Build the future. We've got to think positive thoughts, brother. I feel like my bond with Ryoji is growing deeper. Punk talk. If negotiations with an upbeat shadow fails, you can try again. Come on, how we warmed up, right? How about another run? By the way, you're actually pretty good at running. Not as good as me, though. Holy crap, my legs are shaking. Don't collapse on your way home, man. Later. Sup, you're getting home okay? Didn't trip or anything? But man, I'm out of shape. Felt like I could barely drag my damn legs up on the station steps. This wouldn't have happened back then. I should have kept up running. It's never too late, man. That's the truth, man. We're getting we're only getting started. Let's keep on running towards tomorrow. I'm pretty rusty, but even if I kind of rough, I've had fun. And with you here, I have get some plenty friendly competition too. Plus we we get to talk. So yeah, I'll catch you later. See ya. Hey, just because you seem to be talking to school seriously doesn't mean I'm not keeping on. You got it? I don't know what's as soon as... I know what's what as soon as I see your grades. Want to prove you're turning over a new leaf? Make studying your second biggest habit after breathing. Oh, okay. Mm. This room looks desolate since no, there's nothing in here. I've got a good idea. I have a good idea. Bring me that chair. The one in the corner. You can reach to the beam of the ceiling if you stand on the chair, right? I should be able to. Alright, let's train your body using the ceiling beam. I'll leave you in charge, but you'll need to train your body too. I'm going to whip you into shape, so you better be prepared. You're nice in it, but it looks a bit dead. Oh, yeah. Come to think of it, you brought some plant nutrients, right? Why don't you try using them? I did, didn't I? Oh. I've seen reasonably priced nutrients. That ought to bring it back to life a bit. That's crazy. Yes. That should do it for a while. Alright, let's craft some lockpicks. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I've gotten better. Well, then. Okay, let's go to bed. Hey. Are we able to grab a seat for ourselves? I'm gonna have to end the part soon. Are you have you? Okay, let's read a book. Jesus. All right, we're reading a book. Pirate legend. Hmm? The lone pirate ship sailed forward, forging its own path through the crashing waves. Wow. This pirate captain kid her. Raji should read this bit. Book. 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 Hey, hey. Oh, I didn't realize how long you've been reading, so how far did you get? Seems like you still have some pages left. You should continue some other time. Oh, we're almost at the station. I'd say that was an efficient use of your time. Ah, it's full 20. <laughs> I spent way too much on this new clothes this month. Now I'm broke. Guess you're getting yourself a job. Those job magazines, they have train stations are useful. Maybe I'll swing by, by the Shibuya Underground and pick one after school. Then again, working for losers. I hope I find something easy.
Man, we need cash. Sure, but why bring that up now? Well, we all got sorts of weapons and med shits now, but we can't actually buy them without some dough. So we'll earn some. Oh, like, that's easy. We could get part-time jobs. I don't know. Do we have to? Oh, shit. Crucial was looking this way. Sorry, gotta drop for a sec. Bye. Well, if we sell stuff we find in plans, we can make some quick scratch from the funds, but like Lady Anne said, a part-time job might be the better bet. There are job magazines just through stations, aren't there? Maybe you should pick one up. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end it for this part. Thank you so much for watching. It's been a long one. I'll see you guys on the next one. Goodbye. Morse. Marvelous. Together on the track. Let's go. Red sus, red sus. 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 Red sus, red sus.